Jones in the midfield. To stiff arm to the sideline right. It's out of the eye. Snap to Grossman. Handing off. Thomas Jones. Goal line. End zone. Touchdown. If you had to pick one all-time favorite Bears moment here. Definitely the NFC Championship game in 2007. Cuts inside the 10. Oh. The 5. End zone. Touchdown. Touchdown Bears. Hey. Goodbye, New Orleans. I scored my second touchdown in the NFC Championship game. I hadn't really thought about my whole career until I actually got to the sidelines. I started to focus around me, and I completely got out of game mode because the game was almost over. We were, you know, winning by a couple of touchdowns. And I noticed the snow, the big C you know, on everyone's helmets, Soldier Field. It was just like, literally, I was living a childhood dream at that moment when I actually had time to say, whoa, I'm going to the Super Bowl with the Chicago Bears. I'm the Chicago Bears tailback, like Walter Payton was. I just scored two touchdowns. It was surreal. I remember there was a picture of me hugging a Lovey Smith. We were both getting run on the field and I grabbed him like this, like, and just, you know, was, was hugging him. And I was like, it was like I was a little kid. It was like, I felt like a little kid again. That would definitely be my, my favorite moment. I, I'll never forget that. And I think about it and I, you know, get emotional a little bit because I understand where my journey came from, from being a, you know, a coal miner's son, sitting in my kindergarten, first grade class, you know, drawing the Chicago Bears C with my crayons and coloring it and wearing the, the Walter Payton kangaroo shoes to actually that dream coming true. Let's roll with it, baby. Proud to be a bear right now. You know, my mother and father growing up in Virginia were coal miners. And where I'm from in Virginia is a very small town called Big Stone Gap. And it's a coal mining town. And that's just the culture and the people there. Everyone is just hard workers and dedicated and just very simple. Coal mining, I mean, that's about, when you talk about hard work, that's probably one of the toughest jobs. That's crazy. Kudos to your parents. Well, actually, my mother and father worked 20 years combined. And my football number 20 was because my, my mother worked 19 years underground and my father worked one year and was laid off and couldn't get back in the coal mine. So I, I actually changed my number to 20 when I um, signed with Chicago. And it was for that reason, the number of years that they worked in the coal mines as probation. It comes back, to, it, I'm so far removed from the game. I'm an actor, I'm a producer. When I talk about football and I see the Bears, jerseys in the back. I just have incredible memories of Hallis Hall. And that's actually where my career took a, took a positive turn. You know, I struggled a little bit in the beginning of my career. And then Chicago was where my career actually turned. Three receivers, Grossman, snap, hand off, Jones, come on, end zone, touchdown! Touchdown Bears! Went right down Broadway, baby, Main Street opened up. Recently, just being nominated for the Pro Football Hall of Fame, and, and you see in your names with all your teammates, you know, Devin Hester, Owen Cruz, Ruben Brown, you know, Lance Briggs, Peanut, Tillman. It's like, man, you know, it's like you really did it. You really did it. <laughs>